today's meditation is focusing on our hindrances. It is very similar to our mindfulness exercise, except we're going to be focused on the things that block us. It is a natural tendency for our mind to focus on these things during a meditation, so we're going to allow it to happen. Let's begin with our breath. Close your eyes and sit comfortably and just begin with your breathing. Focus on the rhythm of your breath. Focus on your breathing inward and on your breathing outward. Allow yourself to enjoy your breath and let your mind just flow into the breath. Breathing in and breathing out. Again, however much rhythm you would like in terms of speed or depth, just focus on that for a minute. Our mind has a natural tendency to drift into our anxieties or hindrances. Allow your mind to go toward a thought that may be perceived as negative and put that thought forward into your mind. Allow it to rest in front of you and fully realize that thought, that hindrance, something that may be an obstacle in your mind. If it's not fully come into your mind yet, that's okay. As that thought enters your mind, push it forward outside your body and make it separate from you. Allow yourself the freedom of judgment, of hatred, of anything that would, would, would restrict you in the way that you see this obstacle or hindrance. Focus on that obstacle and allow it just to be. Allow it to float in front of you as being separate and apart from you so that you don't internalize it, but you bring it forward outside. Whatever that obstacle is, even if you're juggling several in your mind, try to put forward just one for the time being and focus on it. If your mind does drift toward another anxiety or another hindrance, allow it to do so. Your mind is guiding you and focus on that obstacle or hindrance whatever it may be. As you withhold judgment, as you withhold anything terrible or negative about that hindrance, I want you to now envision yourself overcoming the obstacle. Put your intention beyond it. See yourself having already accomplished the task of overcoming it both emotionally as well as in reality, physically, or whatever it may be. Allow yourself to begin to flow beyond the hindrance, beyond the limitation, beyond the negativity, the emotion. The. See the hindrance now as something positive, perhaps as a vehicle for your self-growth, for your maturation. If it is a person that is hindering you, in my blogs I talk about not having any enemies, but having your enemies as being gurus to help you in your path toward enlightenment and peace. Without them, you would not be challenged in your personal growth. Without the obstacles in your life, you would be stagnant. Allow yourself to use these hindrances, these perceived obstacles as a pathway so that you can become a better person, a more caring person, a more loving person, a more embraceive individual. As you've entered this state, 
allow yourself to flow forward beyond the hindrance and just embrace positivity and see the word peace and rest float in front of you. Allow your breathing to calm and accept the positive energy that's in front of you. Accept the peaceful state that you're in now and the love that you have. Continue with this exercise for the next few minutes and as you see the hindrance, do the same thing we just talked about. Start with seeing the hindrance as an external entity beyond you that you don't internalize or integrate into your heart or spirit. See yourself using that hindrance as a vehicle to move yourself forward and allow yourself to flow beyond the hindrance. Put your intention where you would like and you will move forward into that place. Take the anxiety, the fear, the judgment, any of the emotional restraints or constraints that hinder you and allow them to go away. Continue with this exercise of peace. Namaste.